workshop. Myself and Henry we sat down uh, and we talked about what is the best way to get awareness out to the general public in El Paso about ghosts, spirits, and hauntings. Um, we came up with an idea, three classes. One class is just a basic classroom setting where we give you a brief overview of what is ghost hunting, what equipment we use. The second class, which is this one, We'll talk about outdoor investigations and we'll take you to Concordia. And, um, and you'll see through our presentation that there's, there's evidence out there of stuff that we've got. Uh, my group has actually, we have stuff on our website, and he has stuff on his website from Concordia. The third one is going to be indoor investigations. We are going to have another class like this. I'll be talking about technology issues with actually doing investigations indoors. And then, um, what to eat someone's house. We'll also talk about the uh, legal ramifications about you know, if you go in someone's house, make sure you have um, a written agreement so you know, bring something that can sue you and all that. The one, and one of the reasons why we did this, there's a ghost hunting group called um, Brought up the walls now because in 1950 that's when more of these 